Hey everyone, it's Will with ManufacturedHomes.com. Welcome back to Where's Will's Manufactured Home Tours, and thank you for stopping by and hanging out with me on the channel. Today, I'm in Albany, Oregon, and we are visiting Homes Direct. And what I have behind me now is an awesome single wide with a whole lot of natural light. This is a 500 square foot, one bed, one bath home that I'm excited to show you. So let's get going. I'm gonna tell you all about it. Did I happen to mention that this would be great as an ADU or accessory dwelling unit? This will fit in many backyards, let alone a piece of land or your community. Imagine your college kid coming home over the summer or being close to your parents. It would be great. This home is known as the Casa de Cielo, built by Palm Harbor Homes. This is a one bed, one bath that sits at 500 square feet. The dimensions of this home is 37 foot by 13 feet 6 inches, and the starting price for this is $75,000. Let's go take a home tour. Where's Will? Now this home may be tiny, but it is sure mighty. I mean, look at all these windows. If you follow this channel at any length of time, you know how much I love natural light. I mean, look at this. Walking into this home, we have a open floor plan, really high ceilings, and a gorgeous amount of room. The size of this living room, everybody, is 12 feet 8 inches by 9 feet. And look at that. That looks great. And before we get any further, do me a favor. Hit that like button. It helps out the channel, and it also gets this video out to more people. And if you haven't done so, consider hitting that subscribe button and that notification bell. That way, when a new home tour is posted, you'll be the first to see it. So hit that. Now, coming back to this home, I mean, look at it. It's great. We have even like planter shelves up there above the um, the refrigerator. We have a nice little area here. You can kind of put a two-person dining room to the left, but take a look at this kitchen. I'm loving the tile work. I'm loving the color. And as you see, this one's set up for a black appliance package. But again, you know, you can always switch those colors to whatever you would like in that ordering process. This one's set up for electric, same thing. If you need gas, you can always change that. But I mean, take a look. In this little tiny home, we have more than ample space, I believe. We have some storage here on the right-hand side to the left-hand side, adjustable shelves, and they've kind of gotten creative with some of uh, the storage areas. You know, you could do a lot of decor up top, um, down below, here we go, we're gonna see a little bit of that. Some room goes all the way back. Um, that's pretty nice. We have a dual sink standard right there. Now the only thing is, is we have one drawer. I think this is the only drawer I saw. So that is the one thing that you might wanna consider. So just letting you know that. Plenty of power outlets in the kitchen. It is looking nice. And like I said, right above, you can do some decor. There's like a plant shelf right there above the refrigerator. That is cool. Now let's go go back here and check out the uh, living areas. I was about to say guest areas, but there's only one bedroom, right? And see, here's another plant sh shelf here or some shelving that you could do some decor with. That is nice right next to the, uh, the back door, I guess you could call it. Um, uh, right here we have uh, more windows right next to that door and that's where that is so that's pretty cool there man the amount of light now the only thing with this home is I think you'd uh, you know have to have a budget for curtains if you know you, <laughs> you need to cover all these windows that's the only thing but I'm loving that there you saw the electrical panel right here is your HVAC unit right in the middle of the home which pushes the air perfectly um, we have a nice little coat closet here next to the door as well um, a little on the small side that's about three ish feet three four feet or so so that's how much room you have right there that's pretty cool and then right over here, we're going to check out the um, the uh, the one bath uh, that we have in the home here. And there we have, we have some linen storage on the right-hand side coming in. A nice frosted uh, window there to let that natural light in. We have some storage over here, some linen storage or whatever you would like, but some nice built-in shelves. Now, this is a nice big 60-inch um, shower I read on the, on the uh, specs, but nice tiled 60 inch shower plenty of space for you to to wash up and get ready for the day some good work right there so this home is pretty cool there's some options too that you can oh you know 
changed to. So if you want to look into that, there's a link in the description below. Click on that. It'll take you directly to this floor plan where you can see some more photos, see some videos, um, some photos, and most importantly, get that pricing directly from a retailer near you. So that's the best thing to do. So there we go. Get a nice little vanity right there. Looking nice. You have even a little space right there um, on the left-hand side for like a hamper, which is pretty cool. And then in here, we have adjustable shelves and a nice amount of, um, of storage space here. That's actually pretty cool. Good show. Good show. Here and then, right there, you see you have room for your stackable washer and dryer, which is appreciated. Um, nicely put right right next door. You, it's it's not too far from like your hamper and everything. That's a, that's a nice spot. And then walking in to the uh, primary, again, the amount of windows are insane. You know, and you know, just keep in mind too that when these homes are delivered. These homes are going down the freeway about like 65 miles an hour or, or more, and none of those windows break. Hardly anything on these walls crack either. Look up here, we have a little bit more storage with a pass through there. If you see the grate there, that's where your air passes through. The size of this bedroom is 10 feet by 10 feet. And what we have sitting there looks like to be a queen bed. Um, so that gives you a good idea of how much room you'll have in this room. Um, or space in this room. Looking into the closet here, we have a wood and a coat rod, wooden shelves, reinforced uh, shelving there. And then right there, you see your whole water shut off a valve and your water access. So that is where that is located in the primary room. So keep that in mind. But this is a cool little ADD, ADU, like I was saying, you know, you could, you could use this as, a, as, you know, your personal single wide. You could do this as an ADU in the backyard. If you're in a community, you know, there, there's uh, spots for that. This is technically not an RV park model because it's over four, 400 square feet, but I'm digging this home. I like it. If I had the room and if I needed it, this would definitely, definitely go in my backyard. Um, this is really cool, but thank you everybody for joining me today. I truly appreciate your support. Uh, your time thank you for watching and I hope to see you again wherever that next home tour is gonna be um, big or small because if you follow this channel you know we do the small houses and the very big extravagant ones but again everybody thank you so much remember to live smarter choose manufactured travel easy and have a wonderful day